hello and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to do our empties um, and our um, favorites for October. So first I finished this body wash. Oh no, this is shampoo. And this is by Swave and this is the Ocean Breeze. It is infused with sea algae extract and vitamin E. And this one I bought because it was cheap, probably like a dollar or something. But it did work. It was okay. Um, and this one I used actually before because right now I'm using a really good product, hair product for my hair, so, so definitely don't really suggest the Twave as a product, as I said, it's too friendly. Okay, the next product I have here is this toilet bowl cleaner, and this is called Lysol Professional Lysol, and this one kills 99% of that bacteria. Viruses and bacteria is going to go fluffy. And it's an advanced deep cleaning power. Um, so, yeah. Um, this one actually worked really well. I would highly recommend Lysol right now and have another brand. So, I like Lysol for cleaning products. Um, it is actually really good. The next product I have this Cool and Smith Herbal Cleanse. No rinse shampoo and body wash. This is specially formula for brittle, dry, brittle hair and skin. Um, this one I used a little bit. Well, it, it was all empty by the time I used it. But um, it does have a easy access spray. So it's really good if you really like to just not take a shower and just or not wash your hair really and you can just spray it on so it is really pretty good um so yeah uh there has been a bunch of things. the next product i have is i have a sample from gardner the whole brand and this is repairing shampoo it has honey treasures so it has royal jelly honey and Polosius extract and it strengthens and heals damage to hair and this is a shampoo and this brand is so good like I highly recommend it and stuff so really recommend that this brand um although there's different kinds and you can use like the different kinds depending on the strength of your hair the next one I also finished is the Colgate Total this is a 12 HP Pro Shield Gem Protection even after eating and drinking and this is in the flavor of peppermint blast. Um, and I do like Colgate, um, Blue Colgate. I use toothpaste from them. They're actually a really good product, I think. Um, just, you know, really, really good, strong product. I like it. Okay, the next step or the next one I have is this. Again, I finished this Crest Gun Toxify and I always use this. This is amazing stuff. So, I always use this at the time and stuff. And that is the all of my entries. Okay, and um. All my empties. So I'm now going to be talking about my favorites of October. Um, favorite book, favorite movie, all that kind of stuff. So in October, and I did read a lot because I do do like a whole three months worth, so it's not really technically over. But my favorite book in October was probably Stevie because I read that. Um, I only read three books. I read I Have Jade, The Phantom of the Opera, and Sadie. And Sadie got a five star. Love this book. Highly recommend it. It came out 
um, September 4th, 2018, in hardcover. This is just the advanced reader proof, and I really love this. Um, very opening, open ended, and if you love true crime, pick it up. Really good. For the movies I watched, um, in October, I watched a ton of movies. Um, I would highly recommend male violence, um, for, like, not family movies, but, like, I did watch a lot of family movies, but, um, uh, that month, because I do have a son that is two, and I don't want him to grow test, but I did watch Made Violent Before You Wake, and I watched, um, what's it called, um, uh, what was it called? The, the Ritual. Um, and the, the, all those movies were really good. I highly recommend Male Violent. Very unique twist. I love that. Before You Wake is also really, really good. Um, again, if you like Mike Flanagan, you'll like that movie. Um, some people will kind of rate it lower, on the lower end. And, of course, The Ritual is very, very well done as well. Um, I've also watched The Phantom of the Opera, uh, three versions of that. I watched The 1925, The Musical, and The, um, the um, Animated one. Um, and I like... My favorite one is probably the silent one, surprisingly. Um, although I love the music from the musical, that's just by itself. The most one that's closer to the story is the actual silent one. So I highly recommend that one um, because the I th I feel like the one that they said that was close to the original wasn't really because it kind of left off some of the parts, like the main parts, because it's an anime short and they have to squeeze it down. And yeah, so I did like that. For a children movie, I loved Hocus Pocus, Coraline, and The Nightmare Before Christmas. So those are all the greatest things. Now, also in October, I watched a ton of shows, like a ton. I watched another which is an amazing series. Go check it out. If you haven't already, that's an anime series. It's really good. I highly recommend it. I got the book so that I could read the book. So excited. Um, and then we also have, or I have also watched um, Creeped Out, which is another anthology series, I guess. And that one's really, really good. Check it out. It is on Netflix. Um, also, I watched American Horror Cult, which freaked the hell out of me, um, so, I would say that the cult is really, really good, it does have some twists and unexpected surprises, I really like that American Horror Story cult, um, and then, um, I really like that, but it was really creepy, like, really creepy, um, so, yeah. Then we also have, um, what else did we watch? Oh, we watched The Haunting of Hill House, which would probably be my favorite of all time because it just made me cry and bawl at the end. Like, I'm a mom, so I guess that's why, because I just, <laughs> and I just bawled all the time. So, yeah. So, um, that is it for, um... Yeah, you know, all this goodness. Um, yeah. So I hope you have a great day and have a rest of uh, have a great weekend and stuff. Today is Thursday, but um, anyway, have a great day, and I will see you later. Those, those were all my favorite movies slash. Um, favorite. I will be doing an in-depth review of all the movies I watched and in the three months and stuff like that. And have a great day. Bye!